Alright, so I'm at this bar called Chopsticks um, over on 6th Ave and it's a big night, you know, there's lots of talent agents there and lots of people playing trying to, you know, get a talent agent to notice them and there's a piano player player up there and he just gets kicked off the stage by this by this dude and this guy just takes the microphone and he's like I'm going to be showing you guys me and my family's act and so he gets his family up there and he it's him and his wife his two daughters and his son um his wife hands him a bag of cocaine and he does he just puts a bunch of it on the table and like the whole family is just doing cocaine the kids are like 12 and I'm just like dude Anyway, so they're doing all these drugs and uh, they're getting pretty high. Their noses are all bleeding, and they start they start licking it off of each other, like they're licking the blood off of each other's faces. And I'm like, dude. Again, anyway, I mean, shit, dude, that's fucking gnarly. But it gets worse. It gets worse. So, so they're licking each other's blood up. And then the dad just strips his clothes off, and he's, like, wearing this, like, leopard print man thong. And he just spanks himself once, and all his kids come up and just start beating the fuck out of him. Like, they're, like, bashing his head into the piano. Like, they're taking the top of the piano and, like, slamming it against his head. And, um, the wife, turns out the wife has a dick. And she just starts, like, fucking him while he's getting his head slammed against the piano. And then the kids, once, you know, he's, like, half dead, the kids just, um, they, they start fucking him. Like, they, like, fuck his mouth, and every orifice of his body is just fucked. Literally. And so the dad is just, like, covered in fucking all kinds of shit, and his fucking... He can't take it, and, like, he just starts bleeding everywhere, and he's fucking vomiting because he's getting raped by his family, and, like, I mean, that's just not acceptable. I, I'd probably vomit, too, but I, what I don't understand is why this is the act. So, anyway, next, he's fucking throwing up and shit, which makes the kids and the wife throw up. They're all throwing up on each other, and then they just start fucking, like, beating the shit out of each other some more. Like, I'm, I've never seen anything like this. So there's puke everywhere, and there's fucking blood everywhere. People are, you know, the audience is fucking puking. You know, that's not good. I don't know I don't know why the fucking bar people let these people go on for so long, but they, they did. So anyway, the wife takes her strap on and shoves it down one of her daughter's throats. The other daughter is, like, just totally covered in fucking vomit and fucking it's gnarly, man. So... The other daughter walks up to the son and they start kissing each other. Yeah. Super incest. So they're kissing each other and the son, like, he gets, like, really into it. Like, he's, like, spanking her and fucking biting her and shit. Like, like this is, like, his dream come true right now or something. And they're, they, they, they all stop for a second and they just do more coke. And, like, the fucking dad dies, like, on the spot. But the family just, they, they, they just keep going. So the mom takes the dildo, or the strap-on, rather, out of one of the daughter's mouth and shoves it up one of the other daughter's asshole. And she just starts, like, shoving it in and out as fast as she can. This girl's just fucking shitting everywhere. She's shitting everywhere, man. She's shitting all over the crowd. She's shitting all over her fucking mom, her fucking sister, her dead father, and her brother. And, like, the brother was fucking her during this, and he was, like, he's, like, still digging it. Like, he has, like, a fucking scat porn fetish or some shit. And, um, they just keep on doing this for a good, like, ten minutes. There's just shit everywhere. And then the dad comes back to life, because he's on so much coke. Like, he's just stimulated, you know? And he starts playing piano. And he plays November Rain by Guns N' Roses while his son is fucking the daughter who's shitting everywhere and the daughter's just, the other daughter's just like in the corner crying while her mom's like slapping her in the face for no reason. 
and calling her a dirty bitch and telling her what a whore she is. Um, so Dad's playing piano, and he whips out his dick and starts playing like extra, like he's using his dick as an extra finger is what he's doing. And he's doing the the solo, the from the November Rain, you know, the one that Slash plays, and with his dick. And um, it's, I gotta say, it was perfect. Like he's a good musician. But anyway, so he's playing with his fucking dick, and the wife just comes up and like just fucking takes a shit on his dick while he's playing the Slash solo. Like, she just shits all over the piano and makes sure that she gets it on his dick. Like, it's like, I'm not talking, like, solid shit. I'm talking, like, <laughs> type of shit. And the dad just keeps playing, and, like, you can hear, like, there's so much shit. You can hear, like, that... <laughs> it's, it sounds like this. <laughs> like, that's what the piano was sounding like, because there was just shit everywhere. There's shit all over the keys and shit all over everything. And... The dad ends up dying again after he gets his dick shat on. And then the kids come up and lick up every single piece of shit on the piano. They lick up the shit on the keys. They lick up the shit inside the piano. And they lick up everything. And then they just start whacking it. And then they go into the audience. And they sing Friday by Rebecca Black. Don't ask me why. But they're singing Friday while they're masturbating. Like, the girls are masturbating, the guys are masturbating. Turns out the wife was masturbating. I didn't notice, but that's what someone told me. Um, I was just too distracted by the fact that there was, like, someone dead fucking on the piano bench and they looked up their poop. Anyway, so they're in the audience and they're masturbating and they're singing Rebecca Black's Friday. And at the end of Friday, like, they sing the whole song. They know it by heart. At the end of the song, they just come over all over, like, random audiences. Like, the girls are coming, the guys are coming, and they just do it, like, right in our faces. Like, I, I, I got a good, like, right here, right here, that, that little boy got me. He was, like, 11, and he just, like, yeah, it was, it was really bad. And then, anyway, so... One of the talent agents get up. Yeah, you probably forgot about the talent agents. You're probably distracted by all the, the fucking terror and incest and shit and vomit and fucking fucking butt fucking wife on daughter action. You're probably distracted by that. You forgot about the talent agents. One of them stands up and just shouts, What the fuck is this? And... The family, they're still finishing. They're still coming all over the audience. And all the all the talent agents are just kind of sitting there like, what? And there's just this one guy who's standing up like, what is this? And once they finish Rebecca Black, once they finish singing that song, the whole family, they, they put different parts of each other's body in different parts of each other's body. I'm not even going to say where. It's disgusting. It's like, you don't even want to know. But they, they all you know, do that, and they they pretty much shove it as far in there as they can. They go, Ta-da! And the talent agent again ask, What the fuck is this shit? Because I would pay to see that again. And the wife, who has taken hardly any beating, she's obviously the mastermind behind this whole thing because she was smart enough to not get raped or fucking shat on or fucking... She got a little bit of puke on her, like, you know, in her hair and shit, but she was smart enough to not get fucking beaten to death like the dad. She goes, we're called the aristocrats. The aristocrats. And she's waiting for the audience, you know, applaud, but they're just quiet. And there's one guy just jacking it in the corner. Like, he's, like, slapping himself and, like, he's digging it. And everyone's just kind of, like, quiet. Like, the only thing that you can really hear is the sound of that one dude in the corner going, Oh. And, yeah, I mean, it's just fucking, it was awful. Like, who the fuck calls their an act like that? The, who the fuck even calls that an act, let alone call it the aristocrats? That's fucking terrible, man. Like, that's misleading. 
I don't even know if they signed up to be like part of the talent of the night, but yeah, I got the show of my life. 